What's going on guys? It's day five on the road. It's 5.30 a.m. and I'm headed to Glacier Point for sunrise. So I've literally just set up my camera and I'm waiting now until the sun bursts straight over the top of the mountain. So that was a successful sunrise. Really happy with some of the shots that I got. I've got one more location that I wanna shoot, but it's just up the road, so I'm gonna jump in the car and head there now. So I just arrived at the U-Bend, love this place. A couple of skateboarders turned up as well, so I quickly got some shots of them. But yeah, this view is just magical. Check it out. You can see why it's a popular spot. So you might be wondering why I skipped a day on the vlog and basically what happened was is I pulled up to a car park in Yosemite and I spotted a person who I know from Instagram who's got a really cool van. So his name's Jess Bond and his girlfriend's called Lova and he's from Australia, she's Swedish and a really nice couple. They basically just invited me into their van to film a van tour. So. We spent all morning shooting that basically. They even made me some really nice fresh pancakes, which was lovely. So I then went and got some lunch and then hiked up to a waterfall, which is called the Misty Trail, I think. And basically the mist from the waterfall hits you in the face, which is really refreshing on a super hot day. So that was really cool to see. So now I've got a really long seven or eight hour drive to get to Mono Lake which is my next location and the reason for that is is the main road through the park is shut uh, due to snow and I'm told that it's usually open by now but you know they've had a lot of snow I think only a couple of days ago there's a big dump of snow here so yeah it's it's going to be a long way around but you know it's a beautiful area and it you know it's going to be fun so I better get a move on. Through the fields of our parts Feelings part always Keeping us close but strange now Dreams holding us closer So I've been driving for about two or three hours through forests and it's absolutely beautiful and I've just pulled over there's a kind of clearing here on the side of the road where you can see over and I've looked on a map and I believe that there is a lake just in the distance over that tree line. So what I'm gonna do is fly the drone over and try and get a really nice reveal shot uh, of the drone flying over the trees and revealing the, uh, the lake in the distance. So if it works out, it should be really nice. So you can see down here, the drone is prepped and ready for its flight. Yeah. 
I've arrived at Mono Lake. As you can see behind me, it's really beautiful. It's really warm as well. And luckily I found a sheltered uh, bench under a tree. So I'm gonna cook up some noodles, have a drink and then hit the road again. So you might be wondering how I got from the car to a nice pool, but basically the story behind it is, I was driving for like a hundred miles through Death Valley in the dark, I didn't see another car, and yeah, it was just kind of crazy. I pulled up at these dunes and I was gonna stay there for the night. It was 106 degrees Fahrenheit, way too hot. I lay down in the back of the car and I was just sweating pools of sweat and I just couldn't get comfortable and I didn't want to wake up dead so I went to the nearest hotel and checked in there it wasn't cheap it was hundred and sixty one dollars and that was able to hustle a little deal because I got there late but yeah it's worth it you know it's uh, it's definitely worth it us English people aren't cut out for this weather at all and you know it's pretty dangerous out here so best to be safe than sorry I don't want to die yet I've got a lot I need to achieve in life so anyway I hope you've enjoyed the vlog it's been a good one even though I've done over 500 miles today it's been really enjoyable some great sights and yeah I'm just gonna relax in the pool for a little bit they close it at midnight which is in about half an hour and then I'm gonna get some sleep and uh, go and have a look around Death Valley National Park tomorrow so keep an eye out for the next vlog because soon I will also be picking up B from Las Vegas Airport which I'm really excited about anyway I'm tired I need to relax good night